Hi everyone, Kyle's here. He's he's being annoying. Come on up. Come say hi to everybody. He's doing that annoying thing where he just like walks around my chair and stuff. Hi, how is everybody doing? I'm trying a new coffee and I'm not making fun of Cindy. I'm actually trying a new coffee. So someone at work gave me these like packets of instant coffee and they're from Vietnam. And if anyone knows anything about Vietnamese iced coffee, like with the condensed milk, it's so sweet. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to try it. I usually like black coffee, but, if, but like I prefer sweeter things in the evening, if that makes sense. So I'll probably like it. I do like it so far. It's just too hot. Hi. Oh my God. So many chats. I'm going to start catching up. Hi, Ariana. How are you? The Rakowski show. Absolutely. We are back in action. Come on, Kyle. Look at him. Come on. He's be there. He comes. Come on. You have to say hi to everybody. God, he's so big. Say hi to everybody. There we go. Mwah. Kyle says hi. Mwah. Okay, you can sit or you can leave. It's up to you. He's going to walk in circles. Okay, he might sit there. He kind of likes to sit sideways. I don't usually like this because his bum is like right on me, but what can I do? Hi, Candy Queen. How are you? Hi, I'm making up for being late last time. But... <laughs> by being early I was like just right on time like I had the stream ready and the thumbnail and stuff like ready I just see hairs floating everywhere I vacuumed yesterday but when you have Kyle you have to vacuum every day or you're gonna have white carpet by accident hi Jennifer how are you hi Federica good to see you I love the girl power sign this my arm says spice up your life I know it's backwards but it'll be front words when we're in the game I think so spice boy Spice up your life and the back says Team Spice and has their logo. Maybe you'll see it if I get up. Hi, Cats and Witchcraft. How are you? Hi, Renika. How are you doing? Nabby says, yay, iconic title. I always try to rope in people who might be curious about The Sims 3. And like most people are like, oh, I've heard it blows up your computer. And I'm like, you play The Sims 4. Like, how dare you? <laughs> Both of the games do that. So there we go. Star Stuff says, hi, everyone. Also in time. Well done. Hello, Nerdo Chia. How are you? Chia. My goodness. I just finished the last stream and wow, Quad Boys love the Disappoint Men title. Disappoint Men. Like that, that describes my whole history. Oh, I noticed that you were watching it because I saw your comment about like the joke I did about birth weight. I don't know. I just I just thought of it. It's something I used to say when I was younger and I'm like, you know what? It's been 10 years, so let's bring it back. Boba says hi, everyone. Natalie, how are you doing? Sierra, good to see you. Sierra with the human name, not the pet name. It's a beautiful name, though. And like and like we were talking about, we always like when our animals have people names. Cute hoodie, thank you. I bought this in 2008, 2007 or 2008. In my first year of university. Danny asks, are we on the next gen yet? We are not quite on the next gen yet. So we might have the air already because we had quadruplet boys. So like our, our like latest girl was like, eight or nine babies ago. So she's already like a child, maybe gonna turn into a teenager very shortly. So she might be, or maybe she is a teenager already. Either way, we are moving through. How old is Kyle? Kyle is 18, 19, 20, He's like six, about six. Kyle is a pig. I got Kyle when he was eight or 12 weeks old, whichever is the correct time to take them from the mother. <laughs> he came from a farm where like they've had cats and cats for like years and years. So like they understand all that stuff. I don't know that stuff. I'm like, give him to me when he's ready. And he's ready. You're drinking coffee too. There you go. I am sick and miserable, but but the plus is I get to skip my workout class and watch the whole stream. Well, well done. Yeah, you like you shouldn't exercise when you're sick. Hi, CJ. How are you? 
I think I missed a bunch too. I'm eating goldfish. They are truly the snack that smiles back. I haven't bought goldfish in years. Goldfish were not one of the cheapest snacks when I was a kid, so I didn't really I grew up with those. I like I've had them like a few times here here or there. We I think we have like a ketchup flavor, like a red flavor, and and, and I like that one. Or the orange one with cheese. Hello, Rakowski and Kyle. Hi, Aesthetics. Good to see you. Hi, Phoenix. I'm going to try and catch up. I have I have my three boys and gave up. You had three boys and quit the challenge. My goodness. I understand that. Like, with, with Sims challenges, I either do one episode or, like, one playthrough or, like, the whole thing. When I'm into it, I'm into it. When I'm not, I'm like, let's just start a new legacy challenge. Hi, Demi. How are you? Hey, we love Sims 3 here. Absolutely. Have we named any of the babies after the Spice Girls? No, but we could totally do that. I would love that. The hoodie looks comfortable and warm. The thing I like about this hoodie is that it fits me. Like, it's almost like it's tailored. It's a smaller size. And, like, usually with, like, men's clothes, the small for sweaters is still, like, way too big for most people. Gray would be too powerful with a human name. Hello, Krayusa. How are you? Sierra says, I'm playing Showtime watching this. Showtime is one of my favorite expansion packs. Unlike what most people, everyone's like, I love seasons and pets. And I'm like, nope, like I would have Showtime before either of those. I'd prefer to have all of them though. There's not really a bad Sims 3 expansion pack. Like when people ask me, which pack should I buy? I just repeat this every couple of streams, but like if you don't know what pack to buy, buy the pack that you want. Like none of them are like, maybe don't get Island Paradise if you're not willing to fix it a little bit. But other than that, like just go with themes that you like. If you like supernatural stuff, you should get that first. Maybe late night because it has vampires, like apartments and stuff. I think the base game comes with late night now though, right? Juana says, I can't stay long pre-K teaching, but dropping by to say hello. Well, hi, good to see you. I hope I caught you in time. I'm British, so drinking tea. I sometimes have tea. I don't usually have coffee after work, but sometimes when I stream, I do. It's Thursday, so I'm almost done my week. I have the Walmart brand gold, goldfish and their penguins. Oh no. Oh, I met my three, my three boy, boy cats. Oh, I remember. Yeah, like I remember. Um, I remember you have the three cats. I didn't I, di I didn't remember that, that, that they were all boys, but everyone keeps saying things like, oh, I started the 100 baby challenge because of you. And I'm like, oh, I hope you like it. Like, <laughs> I hope it doesn't cause you too much stress. I've had the whale goldfish, wh which are, in my opinion, way better. Maybe I'll try something soon. Like, I don't usually buy new things. The food I buy now is the food like that I bought like 10 years ago, 15 years ago. I don't like anything new. I like lots of things though, but maybe I should try something new. I started my own 100 baby challenge and the fa and the founder is called Harlot. I love that word. It's like a Victorian era word for whore. You know, it's not like, oh, she's a harlot. So it makes sense when you're the 100 baby challenge trying to have as many babies as possible. Can we play Project Renee tonight? Yes, we are actually playing The Sims Five. This game has open worlds, great graphics. It runs nice and smooth, color wheel, cars, all that stuff. So as usual, I'm gonna open the EA app and we're gonna see what happens. Oh my God. Can you get me early access for it? It's really easy to get early access for things with with um, with EA and The Sims 4 and The Sims 5. All you have to do is have like a Twitter account with 15 followers and a lot of tweets about The Sims. And then you just kind of tell them, hey, I will give you my soul if you give me all the packs. You sign this thing where you can't say anything bad about the game and then they send you everything forever. That was really mean. <laughs> well done. Okay. Uh, let's see. The game is the game is opening, so that's good. I I usually do all this stuff first. Oh, 
Also, I'm a Showtime stan. It's my favorite along with Late Night and Ambitions. There's a starter pack with with Late Night. Yeah, I was pretty sure. Like, I, I, I don't think you can buy it otherwise. Okay, let's see if I can figure this out. Boom, here we go. Now we can read my sweater. Kyle is still with us. He's a little warm, my goodness. He's not sick or anything. It's just, it's warmer out. I'm in a sweater. Okay, this looks like our typical thumbnails. As you can see, we've got somebody just like standing up in the middle, you know, like, I, I kind of want to say planking or T-posing, but it's, I don't know, it's kind of like halfway in between, I guess. Okay, let's see. Let's go. I'm going to move the chat where I can see it too. If EA gives me free sim packs, I'll sponsor them. Honestly, like, I always joke how, like, you don't make any money from doing it. So, like, for me, I'm like, yeah, then I'm not doing it. But if you want all the new packs, like, you will save, like, a thousand dollars. I wonder if you get accepted to the network if they'll give you old packs. If that's the case, then it might be worth doing it. Cats are naturally hot, too. Yeah, and, like, he's, he's, he, he's also heavy and like covered in fur. So he's like a heavy weight, weighted, heavy fur, heated blanket. Okay, go cemetery. I'm gonna just let the game open a little bit. We all know how I feel about seasons. So since it's raining, I'm like, oh no. Hi cemetery. That was the first thing I thought. Okay, do we have any gifts? Maybe we should open those first. Oh, Cemetery's an elder in two days. Amberlynn still has 13. She's much younger. What are you doing? Playing computer games? What a waste of time. We're gonna accept gifts from a friend. Have you ever watched The Hills Have Eyes? No, but I know the general premise. I don't know a lot about movies and TV shows. If it's not British and culty, then I probably haven't seen it. A sim fest is starting. Oh, well, as much as I love that, we, we really don't have time for that. Ariana got me a enlightenment elixir. Thank you, I'll send you a luxury care. Did you log in again to do that? <laughs> the research station, which we will sell for money. Oh no, I already sent you one. The football. The liquid job booster. I don't think we've seen that one. And if we did, I didn't notice it. Vial of bliss. Excellent. Thank you, Diesel Baby, for the plant. You can have a surprise. Pony pickles. Work in progress by optimal construction. What is that? I don't remember what that is. I'm gonna have to check it out. Is it something you build like when you repair the car in The Sims 2? Flask of angry bees can be found in the... Okay, we have not used that yet. And I keep watching these YouTube shorts with this crazy girl who like picks up bees with her bare hands. Like it's her job, but like, isn't there a suit for that? She's like, I just like grabbed the queen and then we saved the bees. And I'm like, Ah, like I'm terrified of bees. I don't want that. Thank you, Jonathan, for the 400. He knows what I like. I think that's the stereo I bought. I bought for outside. We could put that back. Thank you, Dee Dee, for the bubble bath. There we go. We'll send you that. And then chaos. Yes, the jar of potent friendship. Excellent. I'm sorry I ran out of gifts. Okay. Now let's save. So that way we 
keep those things. We also did a cast makeover recently, and that seems like if I if I put broken CC on them, then that'll be that. I made a sim self with my boyfriend and I used the angry bees weight gain and tragic clown elixir on some townie and he cheated in game. Oh my God. His game is unhinged. Oh good, the maid is here. Okay, I'm gonna have Amber Lynn do some cleaning up. She never really does that stuff. Cemetery, no, go to the bathroom. Take care of yourself. Okay, pick me is hungry at school. That's fine. I know you did how to fix Sims 3 lag videos, but can you do Sims 3 most must have gameplay mods? That's one of my most popular videos. Just go to my videos and sort by views and it'll be like fourth or fifth. Tragedy is no. We just moved you out for a reason. Okay, just do laundry. I was gonna click all three, so that way she does it for sure. Okay, are all the kids at school or did someone stay? No, foosball didn't go to school. Oh God, okay, you're at school. Morg? What's Morg doing? Why is Morg at the beach? In the hail? Let's just go along for this. I think this is like, the, this is the most interesting thing happening in the family. Okay, look at his energy. Look at his bladder. And look where he is. Who's that? Oh my God. This is not safe. It's Dina! Oh no! Let's go say hi to Dina. Oh no, he's a loner. Maybe he'll just creepily watch her. Like one of the children of the corn. What is she doing out here? Hi, Dina. Oh, she's god ugly in this game. She's actually pretty good. Like you just have to fix her hair and her makeup. Like it's all, it's all in the hair and makeup for her. Like that lipstick is ugh. Do you still play Sims 2 as well? I do, I do play Sims 2. We did a Sims 2 stream relatively recently. I've been working on Pleasant View. Sims 2 is usually the game I play off camera and then I play Sims 3 on camera. But like once every like few, few months I'll switch it up or I'll just do like a Sims 2 video if something happens. Or if I learn something. Does it? Does anyone know any houses that have ghost families haunting them? I want to have a family of Sims move into a haunted house. Okay. Any, um, any goth house for sure. Midnight Hollow has a few. Uh, Olive's house has them. Uh, you could also like, maybe you could move the graves from the graveyards into the, like, I'm not sure if that, if, if that would work. I've never tried that before. There's also a family of ghosts that, that live in Midnight Hollow. Can we move to Appaloosa Plains? Please don't put that on the wheel. I don't like Appaloosa Plains. It's too crunchy mom country, ugh. Like I've never seen something with so many trees remind me of Utah. Okay, is he going home? He is going home. This is, this is something else. Morg is gonna end up dead. If I have two babies die, I'll be upset. Yeah, Dina's going home too. Oh, they, <laughs> they jammed each other up on the pathing. I'm just gonna watch, I'm just gonna let the game see what happens. Put Bridgeport on, on the wheel. I would love Bridgeport. I would make an apartment building for us. And I would move every, like the whole family like can live in different apartments. Like once they move out of the family, I would do that. I would make it a whole, a whole thing. The Jalopy Apartments. Cause it would be a good way for us to play as a poor Sim, 
and have a reason for it. Like we invested all of our family money into the apartment building. And now we have to live in one of the units. A hundred babies in apartments? Like, I would build the building, though. So, like, there'd be a way... Like, we'd have, like, two, two floors or something. Or we could live in a penthouse. I definitely wouldn't move into a Bridgeport apartment building. I would make my own, but I would... But I'm not sure exactly how I would do it. And Bridgeport has like my favorite sim in it. Okay, Morg, well done. You skipped school. You are cold and wet. All the children, blah, 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 are going to the Wilsonov Community Theater. That's fine, as long as I don't have to pay for it. Or pick me. She's sick. Oh no, cheese string. Woe is me. And pick me. Pick me is so far in the best shape, but we all remember what cemetery looked like as a child. Sometimes it's just baby weight. Oh no, the babies. I'm just gonna like. Click them and hopefully somebody comes and grabs them. No, we have to go do it ourselves. Cemetery. Oh, cemetery's doing it. Never mind. I can see now. Go cemetery. Okay, Amber Lynn. Oh, Amber Lynn's doing some of it too. I'm gonna have to lock these doors. Okay, please make sure that's locked. Perfect. And then I'm gonna add cemetery to the list. And I'm gonna lock for everyone except cemetery and Amberlynn. This door can just lock for everyone. That's fine. And then who's this? Fried rice. Testing, cheats, enabled, true. And I'm gonna teleport him out. Perfect. Okay, we're all set. Carrying issues. I forgot their names. Disappointment, neglect to, abstinence, and issues. Can we play The Sims 4 multiplayer mod? I don't have The Sims 4 installed. I can't play it. Oh no. Okay, what do you want to do? Which one's this? This one's hungry. Why don't you feed this one? I just want to take care of the babies and then I want to go get pregnant again. One thing I was thinking about, just because I do like to integrate different games into the streams every once in a while. How does anyone, um, like, does anyone here play Roblox? Like, would we have enough people to do that? Like, 8 to 12 people? I like, I like the ones where I can be toxic. Like, I like Eviction Notice, uh, the Survivor one. I like that one. I'm not good at the games, but I'm good at staying in if that makes sense i can actually win if i'm in jeopardy of being eliminated like if it's like oh you're in the bottom two i will win the next game to get out of the bottom two i've never played or even seen roblox but i would watch roblox is like new to me like in the last year and i would just play it because cj would stream it on fridays and i'm like this game looks like fun see the thing is is that it's a bunch a bunch of all these different games and there's so many terrible ones and there's a few amazing ones and it's like free to play it's like microtransaction-y but i don't usually play games where you can pay to win Usually it's like aesthetic stuff. Like if you want your character to look different, but it's not like you'll jump further. 
I thought I thought it was a baby game. That's exactly what I thought too. And a lot of the games are more child focused. I just don't play them. <laughs> what happened? Oh, Morgan Inkbeard died. I thought one of our kids died. I was like, no. Fried rice jalopy is in mourning because Morgan Inkbeard. I was like, Morgan? Like our like we have a kid named Morgan. Have you heard that Jasmine Noon is secretly a party animal? This is not the time. Who cares? Oh, look at this. Cemetery is spending time with Balder. What's Amber Lynn doing? Playing with toys as usual. Do laundry. Wow, she actually did it. Okay, now she's gonna go to the bathroom. Why did she go to that toilet? Can she not use this one? I like this one. Okay, everyone has to like go to bed tonight. I'm gonna save. No, Rec, we would never name a child something normal as Morgan. That's exactly what I was thinking. BRB putting the IRL baby to bed. That's a good idea. Yeah, like Morg. That's that's probably what I was thinking. Like Morg, like Morgan. Okay, Amberlynn is running to prepare mac and cheese. So let's just let that happen. Why is this dishwasher always broken? Why is this always broken? We're rich now. Here, I'm going to put them here. So they're more out of the way. When are we getting pregnant again, or did we just decide on pick me? I will get pregnant again, because we can always have aunt pick me. Because everyone has a pick me aunt, right? Unless your mother is the pick me one, and then her sisters have to deal with her. That's also possible. Morgan. <laughs> I believe Morg is a boy. Half brother. I was gonna say, I'm like, you can't tell by the hair because that's kind of what cemetery used to look like. Phoenix says, yes, my mom is the pick me. <laughs> I didn't know if Amber was becoming an elder too soon. She has 13 days. She could probably do two or three pregnancies. Like if I rushed it, here, we could do that. Let's speed three it for a little bit. There we go, go to bed. Why are why have you not eaten? Oh my god. Grab a bowl. Here, anyone who's hungry can eat now. Okay, you're asleep. You should go to sleep. Pick me in cemetery or talking. Go to sleep. Cemetery's hungry too. She can have some. Okay, you're okay. You need to go to bed. You're doing your homework. I'm going to let that happen. You're in bed. That's fine. Did you pee yourself or are you just dirty? I'm just going to like let him have his privacy. Why are the doors still open? Okay, everyone's finished their dinner. Cemetery is going to help clean up. And so is woe is me. Okay, cemetery, go to the bathroom and go to bed. Or maybe not because the babies might need caring for. Oh no, they're just lonely. That's fine. You can sleep for a while. Kinda need another pregnancy to have an heir after the quad of disappointment. That's kind of what I was thinking. My mother and all my aunts are lovely. I, am, am I the pick me of the family? Probably. Cause I'm a pick me and I use humor to draw attention to myself as well. 
It's one of the main symptoms. Okay, you're in bed. You are not in bed, but you just finished your homework, so that's good. You can go to sleep. You're you slept all night, but you are oh god. Oh right, cause Morg, cause Morg was tired. Okay, wake up. Go to the bathroom. Eat the mac and cheese before it turns green. Okay, you're going to bed. All of you are lonely. Soon you'll all be stinky. Okay, how are you doing? You're in bed. You're in bed. Everyone's in bed. Okay, let's just let's just zoom until the babies wake up screaming. Okay, here they are. Okay, Amberlynn's almost rested. What do you need? Hunger. Okay, feed it then. Feed it, play with it. I can't believe we had quads. See, Harris says my sister is the pick me. Oh no, that's awful. Is she older or younger? Okay, wake up. Okay, three of them are now screaming. I'm gonna have Amber Lynn do all of it. Okay. This baby is hungry and lonely. Easy. Which one is crying? This, this one is not doing good. Oh, I hear a ghost. Who's here? It's Harley. Harley's, Harley's awake again. Every few days. Here, feed this one. Then change its diaper. Then you have to change all of their diapers. There. They're all probably not going to grow up well, but that's just how it is. She's younger? Oh no. I wasn't sure which which was worse, but now that I think about it, I'm like younger. Do not perceive me. Do not look at me. I was a pick me as a kid and now I'm like, oh God, please pick someone else. Anyone else. <laughs> Love it. Okay, all the babies are in the green. The laptop is broken. Let's why don't why don't we repair that? Remember when she electrocuted herself in a puddle? Do not answer the phone. Okay, let's let's go to the bathroom. Take a shower. It's Leprosy's birthday. It's Morg's birthday. Which ones are they? Okay, they're they're gonna turn into teenagers. Okay, why are why are all of you incapable of feeding yourselves? Okay, move that move that out of the way. Amberlynn's taking a shower. Cemetery is dealing with the babies, even though they're in the green. Well done. Fried rice, just eat something. Eat leftover cake, perfect. Happy birthday, leprosy. Oh no, the leprosy challenge. Hi, Harley, come sit in your rocking chair, girl. Oh dear. Okay, school bus is here. You're going to school. Oh, I almost I almost canceled it. You're going to school. You're going to school. You are you are getting out of the bath. 
and you're going to school do homework it's a little late for that go to school you're going to school wow wash all dishes on lot she must be neat oh she's not neat she was just pick pick me was just doing it for the attention then How do you get your sims to walk normal? I don't know. Make sure they have space to walk is my best, is my best advice. Oh my God, leprosy. Run. The bustle wait, <laughs> I love it. They even do it outside. Oh no. Ah, uh, speed speed running homework. Oh no. That's too stressful for That's too stressful for me. Is something being haunted? We have two graves. So sometimes our dead mother and our dead child will come out of the grave as a ghost. Okay, great. Cemetery's taking care of everything. Amber Lynn has wasted her energy on computer games. I'm going to have her have a little nap and then she can go out to eat and meet somebody. Okay, cemetery's coming to take care of the baby. Come on, let's follow cemetery. The camera's not fast enough. Let's go into our courtyard. Josiah Sisk? No. She's a lesbian. Okay, the baby's still screaming. Cemetery should be coming in right now. There she is. Oh no, I'm trying to get the right shot. Cemetery with the baby. Cause she can be an elder soon, so I want to get pictures of her while she still looks like this. Oh no. Now she hears the other baby. Oh, it's that baby. I'm on the wrong side. I'm trying to set up the stage at the coffee house, but there's always one or two random sims that take forever to get off of it. I hate that. You get so many better screenshots in live mode, like if you're building something, but it's so much easier to build when there's no Sims on the lot for like anything. Okay, she fed the baby. The baby's gonna pee itself soon. Okay, Amberlynn can wake up and she can go out. In the motive mobile, I forgot she had that. We didn't even need the nap. Is there another restaurant? Let's go here. Oh, let's go to this one. The town life stuff one. Eat here alone. Then by the time she's done, who's here? Nina, oh my God. It's Nina Caliente, everybody. We're gonna go in. I just moved the Sims into a corner with the move objects cheat on. That's a good idea. The motive mobile is so OP. We earned that. Did you have a baby with you? She brought one of the babies. It's abstinence. It's abstinence. Do we know him? Davis Cobb? He's an eligible man. Hey, Amberlynn. I can't believe you brought the baby. If I get a stroller, let me see if this works. Okay, so I'm gonna go into build mode or buy mode. Why are kids and pets grouped together? I don't, I, don't, I don't know where it is in this. I'm just going to go to function.
There it is. The Twinbrook Roller. So I'm gonna put it here. We're gonna make it different. Here, I'm just gonna copy. Copy this thing. There. That's kind of cute. I feel like it would be the opposite, but that's fine. Okay, now I'm gonna go into live mode. Haha, <laughs> it does work. So that way at least she can push the baby in the stroller. She's like, please, the name of my baby is what I want to do today. It's kind of ironic that she brought abstinence with her. Hey, Nina. Nina's got weird makeup too. It's like they put them in there as a makeover challenge. But again, like she looks, she looks really good. You just have to restyle her. I can say many nice things about Amber Lynn, but a good mother is not one of them. That is the truth. Who's that? Dude, dude la mer? Dude la mer sur la mer. Cemetery is of course taking care of the kids. Like she's gonna snuggle. Of course, the one in the yellow is the one that's with us. Okay, we had dinner. Say hi to Davis Cobb. Oh, you're saying hi. You're saying hi to do. Okay, that's fine. You picked him. Let's do that. Ask if single. He's like, do you have any kids? And she's like, no. <laughs> As she's holding the baby. Dude thinks Amberlynn is being awkward. Did we find out or no? No, he didn't tell us anything. You know what? I'm just gonna talk to the other guy. He's thinking about my crying baby, so let's just let's just do that. Okay, he's in love with her too. Everyone hears the baby screaming. He is he is single. Perfect. So put abstinence down here. And you're gonna throw the elixir at Davis Cobb. This thing is a routing nightmare, I'm sure. There we go. Somebody please feed my baby. Okay, very alluring. First kiss. Oh my god, he does not like that. Is he one of the men that we slept with? I don't remember. Okay. Go on stroll with abstinence. Sergio thinks Amber Lynn is being unforgivably rude. Oh no. Oh, he hates us. Is that his baby? That'd be funny. Okay, she smacked him right back. Perfect. Oh, the Me Too megaphone. Please, please stop that until November. Just grab your baby. Go and stroll with abstinence. She's like, whatever, I'm leaving. What a hater. Oh, the drama. <laughs> Love those elixirs. It makes it so much easier, honestly. And the thing is, in The Sims 4, you like you don't even need them because you can get them in love in like 10 interactions. Yeah. 
Right? Right by the Caliente's house. Isn't there a way to edit household in The Sims 3 like you can in The Sims 4? I don't understand the question. Oh, the baby actually moves around in the stroller. Usually these babies don't move too much. I guess you gotta buy generations for that. What's wrong with you two? Singing to your imaginary friend? Oh, it's your birthdays and you're starving. Then why don't you go, like, why don't you eat? You're at home, go feed yourself. See, this one's feeding himself. Morg, oh, Morg's tired again. Whatever. Okay, why don't we go home? You better bring the baby. Go home. Okay, she took a taxi. That's fine. I'll allow it. In The Sims 4, there's no strollers. Where would you walk, though? In what open world would you stroll with your baby? Oh, she took the babies out of the bedroom. So now like all the all the adults are trying to go grab her. Okay, Amber Lynn is always run. I don't think you're supposed to run with a baby. I don't think that's I don't I don't think that's a thing. I think you can run if you're pregnant as long as you've already like, you know, like if you're a runner and get pregnant, you can keep running. But I think once the baby's born, you're not supposed to do that. Because then it's not in this squishy waterbed. Okay, please feed the babies. Where are you going? Okay, you're going home. Woe is me. What were you doing? Were you swimming? They're all swimming because it's summer. There's barely anything in Sims 4, including gameplay, honestly. Okay, look at everyone doing their homework. Watch Disappoint Men. Foosball, get out of the way. Okay, Foosball is hungry, I bet. You're hungry, you're hungry. Okay, go here, okay. I'm just gonna do this. Perfect. So it's Leprosy and Morg's birthday, I think? Morg and Leprosy, okay, perfect. Leprosy is having a birthday. Morg is having a birthday. Let's go. I should have saved before I did this. Leprosy is a teen. Due to his indifferent study habits, he's a supernatural fan. Due to his difficulties in school, Morg is a kleptomaniac. Oh, great. He looks like Homer Simpson. Oh, one of the babies is in the red. Okay, save. Yay, more cake. Yeah, then they won't have to cook again. I think the easiest way to add the dog to the household. Okay, so like if you have your testing cheats enabled, you might be able to do it. I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna save as before I do anything else. He looks like he's aged 40 years on it. Like, yeah, he, like, he, he looks like a middle-aged man who just got off of work. I can't take The Sims 4 serious with the amount of crop tops they have in the game. Like, that's the thing. Like, people wear crop tops, but like one in a hundred people wear crop tops. You know what I mean? Like, if you're in a public place, like you might see one, but like, it's not like there's a bunch of people running around in them. Oh. 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 
Like, cemetery is the only midriff we can see. And perhaps that's for the best. Okay. This baby is hungry and lonely. It's neglect. Of course it's neglect. Okay, you're tired. You're tired. Okay, you know what? Give bottle and snuggle. This this one's hungry too. Give bottle. Snuggle. Oh god. Easy. Amberlynn is gonna fall off Jenny Craig with that cake. So long, wait, wait, watchers. I love me an Amberlynn Jenny Craig day one video. Love it. And we get one of those every few years. Oh, I think Jenny Craig went out of business. Never mind. Maybe that's over. I know they did in Canada. Okay. Where are you going? Change dirty diaper. What? Where is the baby? Oh, it's in this. Oh, it's in this swing. I was like, are you walking around the whole square? Okay. This this baby is like mildly hungry. So let's let's get a head start on that. Okay, it's too late to invite over the guy, so we'll do that tomorrow morning. He's old, so he's probably retired. Oh, perfect. She's going to bed. Then Cemetery can go to bed. I think that was a successful day. Everyone's in the green except you, and you're just tired. So you go to bed. That's Pickney's bed. You sleep there. You're also just tired. You can sleep there. And then that should be everybody. Cheese string. Cheese string's eating extra cake. Stop it. You can sleep there. Okay, or you can sleep there. Okay, whatever. I don't like The Sims 4 aesthetic at all. It's just like, it's too, it's too juvenile. And it's too like, oh no, she's walking through the wall. <laughs> We've had that problem before. It's just, it's a little too, and, and like keep in mind, like I love feminine style, but it's too feminine, it's too soft. It's kind of like meant to hypnotize you with prettiness, but it's not like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I feel like my brain turns to mush when I look at The Sims 4. I just think The Sims 3 looks better. Granted, that's after like a lighting mod and like, changing absolutely every color that EA decided to use. But once you do that, like it's, it's nice. It's a beautiful game. You can make anything look any way you want. So like, if you want to make it ugly, you can. If you want to make it dirty and grungy, you can. Like even in The Sims 4, you have all those like cluttery items to make something look dirty. Like even the bust the dust dirt, plus the vampire spider webs, plus like all these, like it, it never, looks like that it looks like barbie's haunted house like <laughs> it's social media aesthetic style that might be it too like i don't know if it's just because i'm old now but like when i see what the kids are into like in terms of like fashion makeup uh like a uh, ideal body shape i'm like ew like gross and like I know everyone grows up with like an ugly and an ugly generation, but it's not even the ugly. It's 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 just like it's soulless. It's empty. The most popular people on Instagram have nothing going on behind the eyes. 
It's all pretend. That's not how people live. That's not how people look. Like, this whole thing, like, it doesn't make any sense. And, like, we used to always cheat. There's always been, like, you know, editing photos in magazines and crash diets and stuff. But, like, now it's, like, with AI, with body morphing, with filters, with, like, all those things. Like, I don't, I don't get it. And it scares me that people do. I think was it like 14 year olds want skincare products? Like, oh no. Oh no, you're dirty. Cemetery's been working too hard. Okay, I think I'm gonna wake up Cemetery. She's dirty, but she can take care of the babies. I, is it the baby's birthday yet? It is. So it's the quadruplet's birthday. It's no one else's birthday. Wait, it might be cemeteries. No, hers is tomorrow. Yeah, four, four year olds who have a skin routine freak, freak me out. Oh no. No TikTok, no Twitter, etc., etc. I do not have TikTok. I don't have a TikTok account. I don't watch TikTok. I will watch a TikTok that somebody sends me. And like not any TikTok. It has to like interest me. But like I won't look at any other TikToks. I won't look at the recommended TikToks. I just get off there. And sometimes I accidentally get stuck in YouTube shorts and like 30 minutes later, I'm like, oh no, my brain is mush. I only watch a TikTok if someone I love and trust sends it to me. I have a, um, I have a fun saying where I always say that there is nothing longer than a video that you have no interest in watching. When someone's like, watch this, and you're like, uh, a minute and a half? Like, I don't know. <laughs> you're supposed to take care of that baby, too. Oh, she's hungry. Okay, I'm gonna let you eat. Oh, she's not eating, she's cleaning it up. Oh, no, she is eating. I thought the green stink lines were the food, but it's her. Perfect. I guess we just leave the bathroom door open in this family. I have people that send me videos all the time that I literally never watch. Yeah, you just reply like, lol, or you comment something based vaguely on the title. Okay, Amber Lynn. Doing her job. Well done, cemetery. Okay, cemetery. I want to get all the babies in the green, then we can age them up. Then they're toddlers. Fried rice will be graduating soon. Uh, I don't think that's going to go very well. Okay, she's already doing things. I'm just going to let her do it. Cemetery is better at The Sims 3 than I am, but I'm better than Amber Lynn. Bye, CJ. We'll see you soon. Chinaka. Well done. It's Disappointment's birthday. It's Abstinence's birthday. It's Issue's birthday. And it's Neglect 2's birthday. Only four birthdays. That's actually not a lot. We've done eight. <laughs> Remember the eight birthday day? <laughs> That was something else. Never, never. Hey, Amberlynn, what are you doing? <laughs> you need to invite that guy over. I want to get pregnant before the birthday party. Hey, cemetery just... Amberlynn's blocking you. So feed this one. Okay, everyone else is fine. Use this bathroom before someone goes into it. And you can take a bath. 
Then you can invite Davis Cobb over. Actually, you can invite him over, then take a shower. Okay, is everyone ready for school? Everyone's in the green. It's the baby's birthday, so I don't have to worry about the kids. Okay, fried rice is going to school. Davis is coming over. Foosball's going to school. Your babies. Okay, pick me. Cheese string, woe is me. Leprosy, leprosy. Go to school. Just, just cause you look so old. You look old too. You don't look as old. Okay, go. I think that's all of them. Oh, he's here already. Okay, Amberlynn's playing with a toy. That's okay, you don't have to be that clean. Hold hands. Gotta make sure this door is unlocked. Okay, extremely irresistible. Perfect. Where is it? Try for baby. Let's go. We're gonna do it. He kind of looks like Harley. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Okay, there's a baby screaming, but Ant Cemetery is on the case. Oh, this is a sight. This is a scene. So there's Amber Lynn getting, getting busy. And then here's Cemetery taking care of the kids. This house is a good view, actually. I'm gonna go over here. Ooh, you can like spy on the neighbors and everything. Like it's, it's pretty and it's advantageous. It's both. I think he looks more like a Starian. Oh no. Astarian. I've never really tried Astarian's voice. I don't know if I could do that. I would need like a script to work with. I've been playing some Baldur's Gate 1, like the old game from like the 90s. So I've been hearing different voices. Her butt close up. Yeah, I did that by accident. Okay, great. Oh, this is something else. Leave. Cemetery's like, we'll never see you again. Talk about imaginary friend, no. Just ask to leave. Where is that? Maybe I can't because he's on a date with her. Amberlynn's playing with a toy. Ask to leave date. Perfect. And you're gonna ask to leave, period, if he doesn't go. Confess to cheating. Go away! Ask to leave. Bye. Your heart's all a flutter. Oh my, you never thought you'd use a flutter in a sentence. And yet, who knew dates could go so incredibly well? Why is he walking like that? Is he the university mascot? It's because he just had woohoo. So if they leave after they've had woohoo, they strut. They're like, I had woohoo. Ahmed Barbarossa, I think he's one of the daddies too. <laughs> Confess to cheating. Okay, time for the babies to age up. Oh God, here comes more cake. Do I have enough counters for this? One, two, three, I don't. Okay. Now that we're pregnant. Amberlynn, clean up. Oh, never mind. the maid is here. Perfect. Where are you going? Where are you going? Go to lot? You're not going anywhere. 
Is it graduation? If it's not graduation, we're not going. Of course, cemetery's carrying the baby. Okay. I'm just gonna move these into the other bathroom for the counters. Oh, I only have one counter, that's fine. I only need four. Oh, I can put it in the trash bin. I don't like to do that, it's too cheaty. I think you might have clicked yes to the date. Oh, that's true, oh right, it was a date. Thank you, now I know what I did wrong. That's okay, she's not doing that. Uh, I'm just gonna buy birthday cakes. One, two, three, four. Blow out candles, abstinence. Since abstinence is your favorite, you can do abstinence first. The sink is broken. Okay. Oh no, you're carrying abstinence. Okay, Amberlynn's gonna do it. And then blow out candles for disappointment. This is way easier when we do it when the kids are at school. No, we're not going on a date. Why are they all calling us now? Aw, little abstinence. Which is something that we're not doing. Perfect. Oh, don't eat. Actually, she is she is kind of hungry. Come on. Oh god, everyone's home now. So I'm going to scream. Please age up. Perfect. I'm going to save. Well, I can't save while someone is having a birthday. Now I can save. Have you named any of the kids Mistake? I'm not sure. Their names, lol. Oh, everyone. All our babies have weird names. Is the maid male? Oh, Mr. Langerak. <laughs> we could. I always just assume the maid is gay. Grab a slice? No. I'm going to cheat you a little bit of energy, though. Okay. We're going to age up the other ones. Neglect to... You know what? What's wrong with abstinence? Oh, tired and hungry. Okay. Okay, you're here. Balder, feed this baby. Give baby food. Quit eating the cake. Look at this. What a mess. Stop eating cake. Perfect. Okay, the baby aging up is like not doing so good. Neglect. Okay, neglect is immediately hungry. So instead of taking the bath, you're gonna feed on floor. And then issues, we need, we need issues. Where's the last cake? Is it this one? Issues. Okay, they're not gonna feed the baby while the birthday's happening, so I'm just gonna cheat it a little bit. But this baby, come on, let's go. Where's Amber Lynn? What's she doing? Okay, good, she's feeding the baby. It didn't work. Maybe the baby will age up on its own because it's kind of late. That's fine. I'm not buying a fifth cake. Hey, the kid is tired. Come on, Homer Simpson. Which one is that? What's leprosy doing? Leprosy is literally just like sitting on the slide, 
at the school. Hey, abstinence is exhausted. Who's carrying you? Oh, it's Morg. Okay, Morg. Put abstinence in the crib. Issues needs to age up. There we go. It's Issues' birthday. Have a baby with the maid and name it Langerak. We could do that. She's pregnant. She is pregnant. We can always check. I always forget where the cell phone is because I never use it. Enroll in university. She is pregnant. Perfect. Look at all this cake. Oh no, look at abstinence. Put abstinence in the crib. Okay, good. Some of the kids are doing their homework. Are you hungry again? What's wrong? No, you're just tired. Oh, you're lonely. You know what? Since you're lonely, let's potty train you. Because that'll be like two birds with one stone. Potty train. Wait, which one is that? It's issues. Potty train issues. No. Perfect. Leprosy's curfew is in one hour. If he's out past per curfew, he may get caught by the police. Let's just let him live his best life. Those kids have parental issues, honestly. I ordered pizza since it's my cat's birthday tomorrow and he loves the chicken that Papa John puts on their pizza. Oh, that's cute. I gave Kyle a little bit of cheese because I bought two, two kinds of cheeses. So I let Kyle try a little bit of both, but he can't have very much. They have trauma more than issues. Now I want to order food. I haven't ordered food in like a week. I could. I get paid more frequently than I used to. Not like, because usually in Canada, you get paid once every two weeks, but in Quebec, you usually get paid every week. So it's not necessarily better. It's not necessarily worse either, but it's like every week I have the money if I want to be lazy and spend it. You cannot sit on those stairs. No issues. Perfect. I just teleport him in here. We might need the playpen again. I love ordering food. Sounds sounds yummy. Me too, but I don't like to I don't like to get dependent on that. Like I make most of my meals. I even pack lunch and take it to work. I have a boiled egg for breakfast. So I boil five eggs on Sunday, so I have five eggs for the week. Like I'm usually pretty good at that, but like on stream days, it's like, ugh, it's so hard. I never order food because it's because delivery is too expensive. Yeah, so like when I say order food, I usually go pick it up because I live in a big city. So like I can just walk five minutes and there's like 10 to 20 restaurants I can pick up from. So I'm lucky in that sense. But like, you know, so like instead of spending like 25 or $30 on Chinese food, it would only cost me 15 or 20. But it's still not something I should do all the time. Like I can eat for a week on a hundred dollars of groceries. Hmm, if I got takeout five days and just ate it as leftovers, I might just be able to eat takeout instead. And like where and like where I live, groceries aren't super expensive like compared to the rest of the country from my experience. Ask for bedtime story. You are exhausted. 
Cheese string has reached the current maximum level of charisma skill. Cheese string jalopy needs at least zero friends and at least two relationships to advance. Oh no. I live in a small town, so we don't even have the option for delivery. That's rough. I can get like anything delivered to my house in 24 hours or less. I don't do it, but like, you know, I could like, if I needed like a new mattress, like bam, I could get it. A new stove. Dinner. You can even have like order con convenience store stuff now, which is so lazy. Like I live two minute walk from like three convenience stores. So that would be the laziest thing ever. Go to bed. I'm sick of this. Go to bed. You go to bed. You go to bed. What the hell are you doing? Play computer games. Look at your energy. Go to bed. What is wrong with them? Bedtime stories. Woe is me. Woe is me is tired. Has to pee. Is hungry. I don't think woe is me is going to school. I don't think that's happening. You're going to at least go to the bathroom. You can go to the bathroom. You can eat a piece of cake. I have removed curfew mod because if parents split up, it's terrible. Kids want to visit their parents if they don't if they don't live there anymore. I could see that. That's a good idea. I usually like to keep it on just cause like, I'm okay with my kids getting arrested. Like to me, that's fun. But if I was doing a divorced LP, for sure. I mean, we're kind of doing that now, but we don't let them talk to the fathers. Trying to get some Amberlynn shots. There we go. Why don't you just go to bed if you're tired? Okay, cemetery. Oh no, how hungry are you? Oh, kinda hungry. Okay. I hear the ghosts. Eat on floor. Oh no, what's wrong with you? You're hungry too. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm gonna save. Harley's back. I think we've only seen, what was her name? Rugrat. We've only seen Rugrat once. Hi, Carland, how are you doing? Divorced LP. I don't know. I didn't know what else to call it, but like sometimes when I'm doing a new, a new Sims, like, I don't want to say LP cause I'm a YouTuber, like not a filmed LP, but like when I start a new save file in the Sims, sometimes I just let the story take where it goes. So like, I see how the divorces sometimes happen. Sometimes my Sims will cheat or they'll want to cheat. I'll allow that, especially in Sims 2. What are you doing out here? Look at your energy. Go to bed. It's 5.02 AM. Go to bed. Evil slumber. You're the evil one. Woe is me, the evil Sim. When he gets older, we can have him steal candy from the hundred babies. Sierra has to go. Have a good night, y'all. You have a good night, too. It was lovely having you. Oh, Morg. Disappointment is still hungry. Wake up. You can nap later. Because I need Amber Lynn to sleep because she's going to give birth. Evil slumber. Yeah, because he's evil. I think he's the only evil one right now. Wait, is it a holiday? It is not a holiday, so they all have to go to school. Nobody has an A. I don't think any of our students have been A students. Oh, 
Cheese string. Cheese string's an A student. Pick me's not. Neglect's not old enough for school. Okay. Why does Harley come out at dawn? I don't know what she's doing. She just likes to say hi. This has been driving me crazy. There. And actually, why don't we do a little, little awning moment? Oh. I wanna add something nice. It doesn't have to be functional. There we go. That's kind of nice. We could even wrap around. And we could turn it black. Once all the woods load. Or we could turn some of it black. Why did I think of this? I'm like, I haven't stressed myself out enough today. I like that. That's white? Okay, that's fine then. If you can pick any Sims 4 pack that could be added in Sims 3, what pack would it be? Strangerville. Strangerville or Eco Lifestyle. They're the only two innovations the Sims 4 did. The only two. Everything else in The Sims 4 is from The Sims 1, 2, or 3. And worse, and uglier, and more broken, and with less hours to play it. Ooh, that is pretty, thank you. By the rules of the 100 Baby Challenge, you may age up cheese string outside of their birthday. Thank you. I just, I, I forgot about that because we haven't had any A students. Let's see how. So cheese string. Why is pick me a day younger? I'm going to cheat that up. I'm going to, I'm going to age her up too, because it's technically it's cheese string's birthday. So I'm not sure why pick me is a day younger. It might, am, am, it might have to do with the fact that we used the cake or didn't use the cake or something. Sometimes that happens to me in The Sims 2. So it's all their birthday anyway, but thank you. <laughs> I was like, can we do her early? The other thing is that since they're multiples, I don't like to age up one of the triplets before the others. As a regular sibling, yes. Is it anyone else's? It's Woe Is Me's birthday. It's Cemetery. It's Cemetery's birthday. She's going to be an elder. Oh, Leprosy's feeling rebellious. Who cares? Okay, the toddlers are hungry, probably. Oh, they're really hungry. Okay, Amberlynn is still sleeping. Cemetery is on the, on the case, as usual. I'm going to save again. Oh no, not cemetery. Birthday time again. We have birthdays every day. Every single day. It's like part of our routine. It's like, hey, everyone go to school, feed the babies, get out four birthday cakes. Today is only going to be three. And we're pregnant. All these cakes are still here. Where are you going? Why is he mad at that? Okay, he's gonna go use a bathroom somewhere. Who is the fat bald one? It's Morg. Having cake for breakfast. He just takes after his mother. Ew, this is a weird shot. Why is he doing that? Are you gonna get up? 
Or are you just gonna sit there? This is weird. Morgue reminds me of Baby Cemetery. Me too. Why are you looking at me too? Go to school. Everyone go to school. All the all the toddlers are in are in the yellow for different reasons. Okay, well this one's gonna be in the green because Cemetery's holding him. Yeah, go for it. I'm just gonna let Cemetery do her thing. Amberlynn is still asleep. Maybe we'll go for a ride in the Motive Mobile just so that way she can get her needs up. We can take the Motive Mobile to the hospital. He's eagerly expecting. Go cemetery. Hey, you went to school. Leprosy skipped school because he's feeling rebellious. You're okay. You're you went to school. You went to school. Morg didn't go to school. And he has a C. No, you're going to school. You're going to school now. And in fact, so is leprosy. I don't have time for this. I don't have anyone. Playing computer games? No. Oh, I zoomed in on the on the ocean. Go to school. Be scolded. Cemetery scolding him. Cemetery and I think so alike. This is why The Sims 3 is the best. Like the Sims feel alive. Like they feel alive. And that is not the case for The Sims 4. Not the case. That was nightmare fuel, not going to lie. What world is this again? This is Barnacle Bay. <gasps> Cheese string. She has an A, that's fine. She can skip school. Auntie Cemetery is on it, honestly. She's scolding her, but at least she has an A. What's wrong with this one? Oh God. Cemetery, cemetery's gonna change the dirty diaper. Then you can feed issues. As long as they're not starving, then they won't be taken away. Feet on floor. Okay, Amber Lynn's on the case now. Go to the bathroom. Take a shower, take care of yourself. Actually, then go to sleep, because Amberlynn's awake. So now Amberlynn can take care of the babies. She's looking pregnant, finally. Okay. Issues is dirty, so you can give Issues a bath. Issues is dirty, and so is Neglect, too. Here, you can... Here. You do neglect too. Change dirty diaper, then go to bed. Perfect. Come on, Amberlynn, you can do it. Her bladder's going. Okay, perfect. Maintaining your influence with the nerds. I'm not really interested today. Okay, the computer is is trapped. Um, the sink is booby trapped. Put disappointment to bed. Good idea. Abstinence is in the toy box. What's wrong with you? Oh, you're tired. Yeah. Disappoint men. I have to change his name. I keep I keep forgetting to do that. So let's save and go and go into that. Okay. Edit in create a sim. I hate the grounding because they try to go to school and get in trouble. Just think of it like they're suspended. 
Disappointment. It still might not be spelled correctly, but that's good. Okay, that one went to sleep. Okay, there's nothing really else to do until go go for a stroll. Let's 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 do it. We're not we're not gonna do neglect. We're gonna do abstinence because you like abstinence. I want us to go on a stroll with the baby. Kyle, what are you doing? I hear you. Go on stroll with abstinence. There you go. Pick up your favorite. Why would you say Sims 3 Sims are better than Sims 2 Sims? I didn't say that. I said they were better than Sims 4 Sims. Oh, do not. Okay, the school bus is here. I'm like, why are you going home? But the school bus is here, so that's fine. We'll allow them to come home from school. He got off the bus to pass out. <laughs> Cemetery needs her retirement home. We can call it Heaven's Waiting Room. In Fort Myers, Florida. <laughs> oh, bless. That's what I figured. Sierra's back. <laughs> He really doesn't want to go to school. Ronald McDonald is tired, honestly. Oh, I was going to say, I'm like, that's something. Where are you? Okay, you're just across the street. I don't want her to be too far from home when she goes into labor. I want her to be able to get there quick. Heaven's waiting room, honestly. That's, that's what I've called my retirement homes in The Sims since I was like, a teenager like I'd play the Sims 2 I would always make a retirement home lot just because sometimes I want the elders out of the house and then I can just play them all until they're dead so like that the retirement home turns into the cemetery it keeps it all organized when I was a kid it was just harder to play because like I didn't really have the internet and stuff so I was just playing the Sims 2 the way I thought of it but yeah I would call it heaven's waiting room I would move in the old people play them till they were dead then it would become a cemetery Cause I didn't have mods like send graveyard to lot. Like I didn't have any of that. That's what I call Florida. <laughs> okay, you're getting a little far from home. Okay, you made it home. That's good. I'm gonna cheat him a little energy and send him to bed. Woe is me. Evil slumber in cheese strings bed. Perfect. Amber Lynn, go home. Go home. She's gonna go into labor like now. Perfect. I like how they push the stroller to like the porch. Do you agree with the Sims 3 Sims are the best Sims? In some ways, and in some ways, the Sims 2 Sims are better. Like, I think the personality points for the Sims 2 and the traits for the Sims 3 are both excellent ways to add personality to your Sims. I do find Sims 2 Sims act more unique. Like, the personality point seems to work out better, although it's less specific. The Sims 3 Sims are really good at taking care of themselves and taking care of babies automatically. They're definitely the smartest Sims. Sims 3 Sims mostly take care of themselves. So they are the smartest Sims. I am usually more invested with Sims 2 Sims, but that's because of the pre-made Sims that I've been playing my whole life. 
But then the Sims 2 Sims have the best memories, the best lore. Sims 4 Sims will die with food in their hands, honestly. And then once they die, someone will pick up the plate and then wash it in the attic sink at the top floor of the house, despite the fact the person died in the basement. Okay, this one's getting hungry too. Stop playing catch, feet on floor. Oh, Cemetery's birthday, I forgot. That's okay. I said I was gonna wait for them all to age up anyway. Okay, so Cemetery's gonna age into an elder. Cemetery has reached elder status. She can now start thinking about retirement and basking in the glow of her accomplishments. She shouldn't take too long to get her affairs in order though, because you never know when your time is up. Sims 2 Sims have better wants than Sims 3 as well. I agree with that. Oh, we got to give her a makeover. No, ew. Okay, let's just wait for everyone else to age up too. Because we're going to have age ups and births. Whose birthday is it? It's you. No, it's you. I'm okay. I'm going to trigger the age transition for pick me. Because she because she glitched out a little bit. Go here. Here, just you. Actually, you can use you can use the cake. Oh no! Now cheese strings aging up automatically. <laughs> go, go cheese string. Cemetery's not looking good. Yeah, time is not on her side. After she had to raise twenty something kids. Cheese string is now clumsy. Oh dear. She bow legged. I'm not entirely sure what that means, but that's what it looks like. Okay, she's aged up. Oh, here goes woe is me. The evil woe is me. Let's see. Let's see how this goes. Oh! Sweet Mary Jesus, her, her legs go, yeah, like, 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 like a bow and arrow. That's kind of how I figured, like two bows, two long bows. Oh God. We're gonna need more of those Ozempic elixirs. Okay. Blow out candles, pick me. Oh, she's, she, she went into labor. I was like, what are they all doing? Look at this. As, as pick me goes to have her birthday. I'll go babies. Yeah, don't worry. None of them are gonna be having babies of their own. Okay, Amber Lynn needs to go to the hospital. She's in love with the mascot who just showed up. Okay, that's better. Why can't she just, whatever. Go to the hospital. I wanted her to take the motive mobile. As long as she doesn't bike there. Okay, she is. Perfect. What's Balder doing? Oh, he's tired. Okay, pick me's aging up. We're going to give birth. This challenge is nuts. Look at her dress. I love her. Oh my God. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Delirious is a good name. That's a, that is a good name. Pick me is a workaholic. Do you know what she looks like? Everybody's legacy founder. <laughs> That's what she looks like. P 
pick me pick me pick me look at her new favorite iconic i agree are we gonna have a daughter so if we don't have a daughter right now i will just let pick me be the heir like i won't have another pregnancy slay pick me yes she is pretty like she looks like that girl sim that you spent an hour on because all your legacy is going to be based off of her genetics like that's what she looks like she looks like you made one sim and you tried your very best so pick me is actually getting picked she's trying who is pick me's dad i don't know but the but her siblings are not gorgeous Oh, we got a baby girl. Okay, we need to start thinking of names. So then we'll have Aunt pick me, but we finally have a baby girl. So I'm gonna start setting up the wheel, start thinking of names. You can suggest a name that we've tried before, that that we've had on the wheel before. Caitlin, oh, I remember that. A girl named Caitlin commented on the last stream and she was like, I'm gonna call myself Caitlin from now on. And I was like, that's the best. Okay, so give me a moment. Spin the wheel.io. There we go. So the wheel is here. I'm going to delete everything and I'm going to get it ready. Okay. Stinky, Caitlin, <laughs> I love it. My le my legacy kids all look like Dustin Langerak down to fourth gen. I'm so sorry. Atrocious, I love that. Atrocious, mistake. Should we do like, we could do miss, misused. I'm gonna do that. Mistake. Rage quit. We have tried for rage quit so many times. Natalie said tofu. Gluttony. I like tofu as a boy's name. I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna cut that one. But then when, but then when we have the boy, I'll put it on the wheel and I'll take off some of these. Okay, three, two, one. Spinning for our baby girl. It's misused. Oh God. <laughs> oh. Okay. Let's start. Well, let's start with that. Okay. Misused. We get to pick both traits. Since it might be our heir, we should be able to pick them. Because that's kind of what we did with Amber Lynn. Like, we earned picking the traits, so we're gonna pick them. So, misused. Should we have an evil matriarch? I'd be down for that. I love how a baby can be evil. Evil baby. Miss misused is perfect though. I love it. I'm going to pick evil. Evil and handy, insane. I don't want anything that's going to make it too hard. Like I don't mind having a negative trait or two, but like I don't want unlucky like Harley where she broke everything. She can enjoy breaking all the hearts. Yeah, she'd love that. She'd love that. Insane. Insane Sims respond to events in life unpredictably. They say what they want to, do what they want to, and even wear what they want to, even if it doesn't make sense to anyone else. That is very pick me. Very pick me. Most of our matriarchs have been diva ish, right? Yeah, insane is amazing. I'm gonna do insane. We 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 may also be able to pick future traits. Evil and insane. Okay, let's see. We have a new baby boy. Okay, so I'm gonna put Tofu back on. I'm gonna take off Miss 
mis, mis, misused. I'm gonna take out Haitlin as well. We'll save that for a female. I think these are good for a boy. Okay, one, two. Oh, surprise, thank you, I remember you. Juana, I was trying to remember that yesterday. Surprise. I'm gonna take out mistake just because we got mis misused as well. Okay, one, two, three. Tofu, there we go. Tofu came through. Rage quit is just never gonna get on the wheel, but we still have 60-ish babies to go. He's excitable and one, two, excitable and clumsy. Okay, we've had triplets. Felony for a girl, that's a good name too, Felony. Melody Felony. Melanie Felony. <laughs> Almost stinky, I know. Okay, let's try again. One, two, three. Gluttony. I bet. If this is the skinny boy, then that'll be funny too. Do we get quadruplets again? Let's see. One, two, three. Is there any food ones for now? No, he's too young, probably. Okay. Oh, I clicked something. No, athletic, that's fine. Ath okay, we only had triplets. But now we have a baby girl. I think misused might be the matriarch. Look at cheese string. Eating cake. <laughs> Slob trait, honestly. Okay, well now we're at our third column again, but Sem Ant Cemetery needs a makeover. I'm gonna save as. We're gonna save as, of course. Oh, I'm gonna take off the wheel before I forget. Gluttony and athletic. Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of a nice a nice juxtaposition. Okay, I've successfully saved the game. What are you doing? Oh my god. Poor pick me. Ant pick me. Oh, she's slouching. She's gonna wash the she's gonna wash the sink in the bathroom. Okay, I saved it, so let's just edit and create a sim. We're gonna end today's episode with a cemetery makeover. Pick me is so pretty. Look at her beautiful eyes. Misunderstand would be a cool name too, yeah. Would you do a legacy challenge or is it too boring? It's too boring for me. Anytime I try to get too attached to first gen, that's happened to me too. My suggestion is like always focus on one, one or two for the next generation. That's, that's kind of how I've been doing it. I've been focusing on my matriarch for the next gen and the crazy ant. So like now we have ant pick me and probably misused as the matriarch. We can try another pregnancy with Amber Lynn though. Anything's possible. Okay. Let's, I wanna go all out. I wanna do like old timey glamor, but without having to buy anything else from the Sims 3 store. Ew. Let's just use that as the default. Ooh, I like the houndstooth jacket. Old glam. She can look like she's in a Chanel suit. What are the pants gonna be? Okay, the second one. God, there's so many notifications. She kind of likes her... We. I know what to do. I know what to do. Ew, no. Uh, 
oh my god yes and then i'm gonna give her like giant red shoes or boots let's, let's give her boots it'll help cut off some of the pattern oh no they're gonna go under the pants Hmm, then I don't want those. I do like I do like the jacket more than the leggings, so let's just try and find something else. Maybe like red. I want to make it look old lady. We could do this, but like different pants. Like different. Wait, we'll do that and then I'll change this to like white. And then this to black. Nah. Hmm. Use the rain boots. I could do that. I love the jacket. I wanted her to look crazy, but let's make her look chic instead. It, it's, it's gonna be easier for me to make her look nice than it is to make her look nuts. And the hound's tooth is like reminiscent of her previous style choices. I want a nice heel. Yes, we'll do this one. And we'll make them leather. There we go. What's her favorite color again? It's yellow, that's what I thought. Okay, we can give her a yellow shoe then instead. Red leather, yellow leather. Now I don't want them leather. <laughs> Here, wood, wooden shoes. She's not Dutch. Okay, I'm just gonna do like basic then. Let's do that, let's make them like yellow. And the soles, of course, she can she she can have Louboutin red soles. Even though that's not really red soles, but it's close enough. I just want to see what this looks like in a different shoe. What's the other one we saw? This one? Oh, they can be like yellow leopard with just like a hint of it. And then I'll do the red sole. Yeah, that kind of looks like old lady heels. Okay, why don't we give her a hat? I'm gonna give her a hat now. Cause so far she's just been, you know, you know those bald girls who are all about earrings? The YouTube app keep, keeps crashing. I've been having problems with it on my phone. Cause like I normally just put on a video, close my phone's screen and then just listen to it when I'm working. But it keeps like, maybe like five minutes into listening to it, it'll just like reset and just like not, not work. Then I have to open it up. And like, it's when I'm working. So like, I'd rather not have to touch my phone. Like I'm busy. I want hat without obvious hair. I want like a rich lady hat. I might need some CC for that. Yeah, I don't, I don't like it with the hair. I just want like a giant ugly hat, not a witch hat. Yes, like this. I love it. I'm actually going to copy that to the shoe. That's kind of what I was going for. Something a little standout. I was gonna try and get the yellow better. It might it might look better in a in a fabric. Actually, why don't 
Why don't we do the leather again? I don't like the texture, actually. Yeah, let's try that. That's all right. The man with the yellow hat, literally. I've heard the reference, but I don't know what it is. The Red Souls give Ronald McDonald if he ate. Yeah, but he didn't ate. Oh, I changed her eyebrows. I'm going to make them skinny. Okay, good. Okay, why don't we give her some sleepwear? And then, like I said, we'll do... I only do the formal wear if we're going to have a formal occasion. I'm just going to have her in like underwear. Yeah, like granny panties. Maybe it's her turn to wear a diaper. Oh, the back is all one color. I kind mm, this is interesting. I don't hate it. I don't love it either, though. I'm just going to randomize. One of them's got to be good. Why is there baby poo on this? Hmm. I think this is getting worse before it's getting better. Okay, I'm going to not pick the diaper. She's, she's gonna look cool as a ghost with the big hat. That's a good point. I'm just gonna put her in like panties then. Actually, that kind of matches. I'm just gonna change the purple to something else. Oh, I have a fun idea. Perfect. And she can have slippers, but we can make them prettier. They're actually not, it's not a bad pattern. I like it. It's just not, it's just not good for the slippers. Oh, she can have leopard slippers. There we go. And she's going to wear the hat always. I don't think she needs any other outfits. And I like her makeup still. Look at baby cemetery. Ant cemetery. What about a robe? That's a good idea too. Why don't we try a leopard print robe? The color of their blood. Oh, I, I kind of like the red trim. Ooh, that was an accident, but I like it. I'm gonna do it on the slippers too. It doesn't look good with her hat, but it'll look good when she's a ghost too. How long Sims 5 take? <laughs> it'll take Sims 6 in 2056, honestly. I guess technically now we're old money. Okay, that looks good. Yeah, I'm gonna accept it. I'm gonna move myself back. Actually, we're just gonna save the game and have a little chat. And then that'll be it. I'm gonna save as. My goodness. Okay, give me about 10 to 20 seconds and I will join you full screen and we'll say good night. We'll say goodbye to Kyle. He's on the pillow, so you'll be able to see him better when I when I switch the camera. And you know me, I always save twice for luck.
Okay, maybe 30 seconds. Kyle's over there. Hi, Kyle, you're like camouflaged. Did you see the eclipse? Yes, I live in the path of totality and I saw it, I took pictures of it. I'm like, I took one picture of it and then I took a picture of the crowd looking at it and then I just spent the rest of the time enjoying it. I remember seeing it like cover, it was like, it gave, it gave me goose pimples. Like, I'm not a particularly spiritual person. I don't believe in a lot of things, but I do believe in like astronomy and science and all those things. So just to be able to see, you know, to have myself proven right again. I'm like, ah, there's the moon going in front of the sun at the precise time we knew it was going to. <laughs> so I enjoyed it. It's like a cosmic experience. Like for me, the ideal end of the universe is like, just a big rock coming to land right on me. Like, if we're all gonna die anyway, I want it, I want to see it hit me. I wanna feel the heat. <laughs> Aw, good night, Reckon Kyle. That photo you took of the crowd was so cool. Yeah, I put it in the Discord, I think I remember that. <coughs> and you can see the moment why people thought it was religious especially before they had access to the tools yeah because the thing is is that it gets like a little darker for a while like it's like it doesn't like it's not an instant thing but it is so like it gets steadily just a little dimmer and you're like hmm it's not as bright as it used to be and then it's like whoo and then like you're just in at nighttime level darkness for like three minutes and then it comes it just disappears right and then it's just back to normal i thought my save got corrupted because my sims kids imaginary friends disappeared then i found them in their inventory my kids always have those things in their inventory okay i'm gonna grab kyle and we're gonna say good night because i have to eat Kyle's on his pillow. Kyle, look this way. He won't face the camera. Probably because of the lights. Poor Piggy. He's so big. He's so big. Look it. Look it. Kyle would like to remind you to hit the like button and subscribe before you go. Now he thinks he's gonna get food because I gave him a little bit of attention. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Like I said, don't forget to hit the like button or subscribe before you go. And if you find yourself missing the start of the stream, my God, I burped. If you find yourself missing the start of the stream, feel free to turn on the notification thing so that way it can pop up on your phone. I still haven't done that yet. So like, I'm not like, for me, I only really watch CJ and I know he's streaming now. So like, I'll just go click on it. But like, if I'm busy, he can wait. That's the way I see it. But anyway, good night, Arthur. Good night, Cats and Witchcraft. Good night, Sierra. Good night, him. Good night, Star Stuff. Good night, Renika. Good night, Ariana. Good night, Boba. Good night, Neon Yakun. Good night, Phoenix. Good night, Natalie. Good night, Jordan. Good night, Candy Queen. Good night, Sierra. Good night, everybody. I hope you had a wonderful time, and I will see you all next week with a new stream on Tuesday. So until then, I love each and every one of you, and we will see you in the next one. Bye.